problem with a lot of dealerships is that they're always they're always short thinking. Um, they they think short term. So a lot of dealers now are considering eliminating the BDC departments. The reason why they're considering uh, eliminating BDC departments is because of the ratio of phone calls that are being answered. You know, a lot a lot less phone calls are being answered. Uh, a lot less phone calls are coming in. So uh, they're thinking about giving the calls back to the sales team because the sales team are sleeping on the floor waiting for ups. Yeah, I think... You know, I think it, it really depends on your dealership. It, you know, it, you can have a, a cradle to grave work. You can have a BDC work. But the problem with a lot of dealerships is that they're always they're always short thinking. Um, they, they think short term and and they wonder why a BDC is not working, but they've never put time in the, the fact that they need great managers in that department. And so, you know, just like they pay, you know, their 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 reps like glorified receptionists, they also don't pay their manager like an actual manager should be paid. And so then they get, you know, you know, Susie, the dealer's daughter or a cousin of somebody's in their running department because she has a degree. Well, that's not going to work. Like you've got to get a true, like a person who can sell, a person who can lead a team, a person who can be innovative, a person who, uh, knows how to to put a, a good team together and a good culture together to raise the bar. <laughs>